Welcome to Money Talk on WBIM-TV. I'm Susie Neal. Today, we're talking life insurance and how to choose the right one. Before we begin, if you have any questions for us at Money Talk, email AskSusie at WBIMTV.com. All right, when it comes to life insurance, all policies fall into one of two categories, term or pure insurance, and the many variations of whole life, which combine an investment with pure term and build cash value. My advice, keep your investing and insurance completely separate. I've looked over tons of policies, not only is whole life insurance expensive, but the returns quoted by agents are simply guesses, not reality. There are simply better places to invest, but we'll chat about that another day. So when should you start shopping for life insurance? As soon as you have financial obligations or dependents. I bought insurance when I was 25 years old. Back then, I was single, had a mortgage, and in the event of my untimely death, I made sure my mom would have enough money to pay off my condo and keep it. Also, buy while you're healthy. The older you get, the higher the rate because we face more health challenges as we age. And speaking of health, tell the truth on your insurance application. Before a claim is paid, the insurance company investigates. You don't want your family left without a dime because you were shady on that application. Next, buy enough term coverage to fill your needs and match the term of that policy to your needs. For example, if you have a 30-year mortgage and a five-year-old, get enough term to cover the length of time it will take you to pay off that house and add a 20-year rider to get that kid through college plus a few years. In this economy, grads are not landing a job right out of school. And with generally low rates to choose from, life insurance is no place to skim. So, ready to get covered? Find a local agent to help with your needs or use the web to shop and get plenty of good quotes in your pajamas. Comments or questions, email AskSusie at WBIMTV.com. Until next time, thanks for watching Money Talk.